Hi everyone, Stephen Campbell here, founder of virtualghostwriter.com and creator of the course, How to Integrate OpenAI's GPT-3 with Bubble.io. Uh, in the feedback from the course, I found that persons would love to know how to build an app uh, fully and go into some of the nuances with the workflows and a little bit into the design. So I decided to do this app for you to demonstrate OpenAI's reach in terms of their summarization feature uh, specifically and how we would get that done in Bubble, the no-code app builder. So I will demonstrate too long didn't read .co. That's the domain name I chose to put with this application. I, I chose to call this application TLDR as it's the feature that OpenAI uses for its summarization. I'll demonstrate how to pull long text in via copy and paste and also how to upload a PDF and get it extracted and also simplified or summarized. Okay, so let's get right into it. So to demonstrate the app, I did a quick Google search on automatic summarization and I found this Wikipedia article. I'm just going to grab some text to see how OpenAI does with the summarization of this text. You can choose to edit if you want, put a space. I'll just leave it as is and hit simplify and see what comes up. So OpenAI will, this is sent as a prompt to OpenAI and it returns a result based on the context given here. Uh, just looking at this, it seems not to be pointing in the direction of abstraction-based, aided summarization, extraction-based. But what I have found, although it does mention some abstractive summarization and so on, you can actually pause the video and read and compare. But what I have found is doing it more than once or repeatedly actually improves the summarization as you go along. And you can, you know, grab each uh, summary and compare. Uh, I'll just read this one. A good summary is too often a machine-generated paragraph that would lose that push for a human to read more compared to the original. Yet, discovery of the most salient segments or topics is critical for providing a good user experience. And it goes on. So, And it's, it's very interesting that uh, we are doing summarization and getting summaries of machine-aided summarizations. Okay, so let me do the one with the PDF. So let's do the PDF section of the application. I just Googled uh, cancer and I found a cancer-related PDF. So I downloaded that and I'll upload it to the app. It's from cancer.org. So it's completely uploaded and it's also extracting. So total lines extracted 88 and there's a max page limit of three that was reached. Only those pages were parsed and we'll get into that when uh, we start building the app. So you can see that the text from the PDF, the first three pages at least, were extracted to our extraction box here. And we'll just hit simplify to see what kind of results we get. So this is being sent as a prompt to OpenAI and OpenAI is delivering a result. So it says the world is ending and you are not prepared. So let, let's see what happens if we go again. Uh, I, I just included uh, this bug in it to show you that the app is not perfect and I didn't design it to be perfect right now. It's a demonstration of what can happen and what will happen when you try to set up API calls with open AI and I'll, and I'll show you what happened as I get into the app. So just hitting simplify a second time, it summarizes and says cancer is not one disease. It's a complex group of diseases. Cancer cells grow and divide in an uncontrolled manner and crowd out normal cells. So that's a very good simplification of an entire cancer related document. You could actually just pause the video 
or go through slowly and read and compare what uh, the simplification was. And I'll show you a little bit of the engineering that goes into getting such a concise statement. So let's move into building the app. 